While it's true that a can opener works on soda cans just as well as they work on food cans, I find that it's much easier to get at all that useful metal with a knife and a pair of sacrificial scissors by gutting the can with a knife and then making your way around the circumference with the scissors, preserving as much of the flat metal as possible while being extra careful because the aluminum can be awfully sharp and pokey, which is why I like to go in and straighten up and trim the edges before starting on my project. From here, you can almost think of this as a 9.5 by 20 centimeter piece of metal paper and that it's so thin that it's easily manipulatable and can be cut with scissors, hole punch, and even be embossed with a ballpoint pen to aid in transferring patterns, scoring the aluminum, and general revelry. And if all that's not your speed, you can run it through a craft pasta machine to create aluminum strips, like say if you want to make little metal labels. This is just another example of an often overlooked art supply that you probably have in your bin. So the world is your oyster for aluminum can experimentation and slash or I'll be getting into a few example projects in the next few videos.